Dear friends, the rule of law matters to all of us, to the entire human family. All societies need to be based on the solid foundations of adherence to the rule of law. No community can function well outside the context of the rule of law. In its absence, there is no order, only anarchy. There is no justice, only unfairness and oppression. There is no progress, only decline and decay. Because without having judicial reforms and rule of law, we will never have a stable economic development, fair and well-functioning civil society. It is very important for me that we continue to have measurement and the definition of the rule of law and how it is adhered to. And that when we do that, we should use uh, internationally accepted norms and standards. Uh, I say so because in my view, the universality of the rule of law cannot be overemphasized. In the developing world, we generally have a political leadership that always looks at the rule of law as a foreign imposition from the West without regard to the fact that the rule of law is in fact probably even more important for the developing world. If you want to improve the rule of law, you need a way to measure it. The World Justice Project's Rule of Law Index helps the global community by doing just that. It offers independent, comprehensive data that can be used to drive policy, set benchmarks, and guide successful program development. That brings in change. That brings in progress, social, economic, and political. Until the World Justice Project, there wasn't a good universal definition of rule of law, and there weren't any studies that measured it across the globe in a concrete way. The World Justice Project's Rule of Law Index is a useful tool. It takes a very complicated but important concept or topic, the rule of law, and breaks it down in a rigorous but accessible way. There are a number of things I like about it. One is that it combines expert opinion with public opinion, which is unusual. Most indexes, it's a choice of one or the other. It covers many countries, almost 100 countries and maybe more soon, and it covers both the United States as well as countries in, on the developing world side. So it's not a one-sided index that's only looking at some parts of the world. This is a powerful tool. It's a tool that can take the deficits and the needs of a particular justice system off the dusty pages of legal text and put them into reality. We've seen these index scores and rankings cited by everyone from heads of state to journalists to citizens all around the world. It's helping transform the global conversation about the rule of law and in doing so providing a new source of knowledge that can improve lives everywhere. But we cannot sit back on our laurels. Strengthening the rule of law is a never-ending process. No society has ever attained, let alone sustained, a perfect realization of the rule of law. That is the challenge that lies before us. Thank you for supporting the rule of law.